know if the vlog is going to start here or continue here. But anyway, it is Saturday afternoon. I literally got up around 12. It is now 1 p.m. I got up at 12 and I've just been sitting. Like, I had zero strength to even, like, make breakfast. So I started making breakfast now. I'm, I'm making a ginger tea because my throat could use it. It's also my mom's birthday. Um, but also one of my aunties is sick, so I need to go visit. Like, I've wanted to go visit her for a long time, but things have been crazy hectic in my life. So, yeah, that's the plan for the day. This is the end result. I totally forgot I was vlogging. Honestly, a lot is going on. We also got a Sprite, because life, you know what? One struggle at a time. It's fine. We've already drank the ginger, now we drink the soda and the match. I was gonna unpack my bag and then I decided, why not show y'all what my backpack usually looks like? Not usually, I mean, this is yesterday I was having an overnight, so it's a little bit different. So we got the hair. This was the hair I had on my head, which obviously later in the evening I got tired. And then I packed this bag. I wanted to go jog yesterday after work. I did not because I figured I'd be more tired for the overnight. I always have some. Uh, <laughs> I always have some body spray on because, like, you know, we need to smell good. And then the headscarf. I usually put this on after I do my hair, especially when I've been using this, just so like it actually stays intact all the way to work. So I usually have that on all the way to the bus. By the way, I, I remove it when I get off the bus. And then we got the wallet. Mm -hmm. My friend, una shingapi, kona mashi, ano, ukona wealth. Some paper from work, and then this is where I write my daily to-do list. And what else? Let's see, more paper. What's this? Oh, this is the form I'm supposed to fill. Uh, actually, I already filled this. Why do I still have more? Okay. Okay, eh, it's getting dusty. We have a mask on yeah other than that i had like i had a bunch of bags yesterday i had a bag for like containers i had a bag for shoes i need to get a bath and get dressed because we are leaving in what we are leaving in an hour and oh by the way guys this is the present that i got for my valentine's day we did a valentine's thing at work i didn't really um record it because again like recording things at work is still weird for me we had a company breakfast and then um we had the the friday before if not there's or something we had picked out um names for secret valentine and the one that picked me is literally one of my favorite people in the office she's so sweet she's so cool like i love her and like she picked me and this one day we we're just having a conversation in the office teasing around and i was like you know what the only two presents i like food and money and i didn't go to details but if you've watched my videos you know the reason i don't like actual presents is that most of the times people don't get stuff and so rather than like having something that i'm not using which i end up throwing because i don't like keeping stuff in my like um if i'm not using it and so i always like would rather get money and like actually buy something that i could use and so is she understood the assignment she gave me money and i was so happy um <laughs> Birthday girl. Hi. So it's a little bit of a little bit of a
good. What song is it? It's beautiful. It's the camera, my mom. It's not you. Hey, Cameron. Hey, sweetie. How are you looking with that head wrap? You look like you're in Dubai. <laughs> Madam Makeup Queen Kamoko to Fokia in a very special way is her eye. We are okay. Yeah, the presents have started early. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Plasma only for baby in a pizza. Where pizza? Yeah, pizza. Hello, hello. Washrooms. The sinks are nice. Oh, yes. That's the look. We don't look deep. We did not dress up, but we are in a crop top, which I love to wear, and I rarely get to wear in the city. So, pretty cute. The next day, as you guys can probably tell, it's been busy. I literally go home at like 12, yes, almost 12 p.m. 12 a.m. Did not like I had a rough night. I can narrate it some other time, but anyway, we slept, slept so much. I ended up sleeping in, but I made it to church. Service was nice. Obviously, we went to get our hair done. I was gonna vlog that, but then it just so happens the salon that I went to. I'm in the middle of renovation, so we ended up doing the hair like literally outside the salons. Thank God I'd already washed my hair so I could do braids. Other than that, I am, oh, I've not eaten all day. I'm eating now. This is the, I'm eating le yesterday's leftovers, imagine. But you all know, I will not waste anything. But those are the fries, pizza, some of the kebabs, and of course a Coke. Yeah, why am I out? Please explain to me why I'm out of breath. <laughs> Girl is tired. Also need to get those ironed and just basically clean my room because again it's a mess. If you wanna know my life is not in the best place, my room is always messy when I'm overwhelmed. But yeah. Also watching forecasting love and weather. Um the new TV show with why is a pretty face? Fight me yeah. This this woman is literally one of my favorite Actresses of all time. I really love her from City Hunter to date. Love her. Ha and Sonka. Oh, yeah. Hey, pretty. Hey, pretty boy. There we go. Yeah. I love him. But the thing is. Love him. My thing with him is that most of the TV shows. I, the theme of his character in most tv show is like he's this sexual person i don't i don't know how to put it but then if you know you know from love alarm he was like the guy that instigated the kids from like and then i didn't watch navilera which probably that was the one series where he wasn't like you know some super sexual boy i don't know and then there is um nevertheless which 
I really was excited for nevertheless and then I watched maybe like two episodes if not one and I was like it feels like I'm watching a Hollywood TV show rather than a K-drama because one thing about K-drama is that they're usually conservative and so you don't even get that last vibe that is all over an episode um, that is all over a series. K-dramas are usually just you know pure and lighthearted. And so that's not the vibe that nevertheless gave me. So I'm really excited for this one. I really, really hope. And also his character this time around is at least a little bit more bubbly. It's not, he's usually this, you know, bad boy. Yeah, he's usually this bad boy. Yeah. So I feel like in this one, he's not necessarily a bad boy. Though I saw a clip on IG, so it's gonna get hot or whatever. But hopefully it's not as much as all of the other other than that i think i want to end the vlog here just basically because if you have noticed from my latest vlogs it's a really overwhelming time to me i mean i'm fine thank god spiritually emotionally i'm still doing great i'm still will always be doing great i'm not looking forward to any breakdown i'm trying to um rest and work as much as possible um the first month was a bit chill but i think with work it's getting a little bit more demanding not even that much demanding just between that and like digital um trying to come you know making youtube videos making reels and you know i have all these ideas of things that i should be doing but like i don't have as much time so trying to make time for them and then acting i'm really trying to learn more and then writing i'm trying to learn more about writing i'm trying to write um i haven't even been able to finish a book this month in feb uh we're preparing for an album with the band okay worship team sacred i like calling them the band because i like bands okay so between all of that it's really been hectic for me from doing one thing and concentrating on and from doing everything at home to like having all these places to be and then so yeah it's been pretty chaotic but you all know i really love being not just being busy but being productive making life happen like whether it's going to birthday dinners with my mom or um doing work in a corporate company or you know editing a youtube video for me i just love being productive or it's like being there for service worshiping god reading the word like for me, as long as I'm being productive, I'm doing exactly... Oh, my hand hurts, but I need to finish this. As long as I'm doing what God has aligned for me, that's all that really matters. And um, it's it, it's challenging. It's, it definitely is. Balancing everything, coming up with a schedule. But I'm doing it. I'm doing it. And so I think that's the phase of life that I'm in. Juggling a lot of things. Like way more things than I think I can handle. It's definitely the Holy Spirit through and through so yeah i'm very very grateful i know that this is a setup for even better and more yeah that's it for my chit chat um leave a comment down below of anything that you're what phase of life you're going in grow uh, growing in going in what's happening in your life right now let's chat down below i know there are a couple of you guys that like see these videos and like have things that you can relate to leave the comment down below like i know there's few of us but let's like make a little community a little family let's have conversation down on the comment section yes thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video bye Sunshine.